So I hope everyone had a Merry Christmas and Happy Holidays because I def I I can't even speak. I know I did. So let's get right into it. So what's going on, everyone? It's your boy Oosh, and as always, back again once again. And I'm not, you know, it's funny because like I never remember if I ever do these like unboxings or like Christmas videos here on the channel. But I'm pretty sure in the past I have. I maybe just haven't been as consistent, which is why I'm like confused as to even if I've done these. But there's some special things that were sent to me um, that come from Nasir, aka the creator of Legend of Dragon Ball Tale. And as far as you, some of y'all might know, like it, 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 it has meant a lot to me to have gotten so close with Nasir because, I mean, like we all love what he's done with his work with legend but honestly like mans is such a kind sweet person he did include a little extra with the gifts that i was given um both from my girl and brother ooch which is insane because they were like on the same wavelength and so with the combination of the two of them i am now able to like basically say i i own like a lot of nasir's like art and a lot of it is obviously legend um, related. And most importantly, or more importantly, what I'm going to obviously unbox here um, in these packages, which, by the way, one of them, he literally designed Vegeta on the actual, like, shipping, like, package itself. And, like, I can't throw this away. <laughs> <laughs> I cannot. So yeah, it's pretty much sim uh, as simple as it seems. I'm just gonna pull everything out and kind of show y'all every single thing that he sent. Uh, unbelievable! I'm sure some of this is already gonna look familiar. This was the actual poster of the tournament that we saw in Legend, which is pretty sick. And obviously the, the greatest fan film in history. Now that is a fact. I will definitely ding to that because that is 100% truth. So let me just take these out of the slip so I can like show you guys exactly what how they look. And the plan that I have is I'm going to frame, I want to say like all of them because it will make a great set over on the uh, Full Power Podcast. Oh man, he, yo, he hooked it up with Broly, dog. Look at this. So this print is a Broly original right here. That looks amazing. I love it. It looks so fire. I, and like, this is what I mean. Like, this is the stuff that you like. You kind of have to frame. You know what I'm saying? Like, you can't, you can't not. Okay. Then here, it, this is like an actual pamphlet. Like, the material he used for this paper makes it feel like this was legitimately happening in, in real life somewhere. But again, if you go back and watch the movie, you'll know that this was literally sticking in the background on one of the poster boards, you know, with other information and all that kind of stuff. And this is the fight that was happening between Goku and Chi Chi in the Happen in Legend. And then of course, the big movie poster. Yes! I wanna say this is like a 12 by 18. I'm gonna have to obviously ask him all the sizes of all these. That way I can get the proper frames. Oh, and she even wrote to Uchi Love Crystal. Thanks babe, I appreciate it. Ah oh, man, look at this. This is so nice. And it has literally like all the the folks that was involved at the bottom. This looks like a legitimate, like, I'm telling you, like, you know it would be really cool if one day we could, like, go to a theater to watch this? That'd be super dope. I would, I would, uh, I would really much love to experience this in, like, a big theater. And who knows, maybe down the line, if he does put out Legend 2 and 3 and all that, it could be, like, one long trilogy showing in one shot type of thing. So then lastly, he adds, like, this, um, this author's note or, like, artist note. I'm gonna try to read his handwriting as best as I can without butchering it. So it goes, my G, <laughs> to the first of many dope-ass projects. To the first of many dope ass projects, hope these look good on your wall. And it says, Crystal is very sweet. She knows me. That indeed she does. She freaking got the Broly, John. She knows her man, okay? She definitely does know her man. This is my guy right here. And then of course he signs it right there. That's pretty, that's pretty awesome. And now for all the other art pieces that was uh, gifted from Brother Ooch. Oh my goodness. There's so much. <laughs> first things first, he sent these what look like I'm not I'm not sure if these you would consider these like business cards you can see what these are looking like they're like these little shots of it look oh yeah these are these are pretty cool so from what I can gather 
This is like behind the scenes of the set. Oh, that's sick. That's Nasir. He's like behind the camera with Goku and Chi Chi. That is so cool. And Vegeta. That is so neat. And that's him posing with the with the cast of his creation legend. This is so this is sick. I didn't realize what these were. This is the first one that uh um I saw. So like yeah, they're all on set and uh Look at that, Goku and Vegeta just having like a, a freaking arm wrestling contest. That's so cool. Yeah, that's all of them right there. Here's the note that he left with this one. He says, to newfound family across the... the, the <laughs> Is that the boundary? Okay, so yeah. So to newfound family, congrats on a thousand subscribers. You deserve 10,000 or more. Uh, much love, Nasir. So, of course, he signs it right there. Oh, I can point right. Yeah, there it is. Yeah, of course, he is talking about the Full Power Podcast just hitting... Uh, a thousand so if you haven't uh go ahead and please subscribe over on that channel and now to get go over all of this art that i now have to f figure out how i'm framing and what i'm doing with everything so this looks like a smaller version of the movie poster that i was i just showed you guys uh, a little earlier Ooh, yeah so check this out so this is like a smaller print of the movie poster that we saw and this is another version. This is actually one of, this is like the cover of the VHS tape, if I'm not mistaken, which we're gonna talk, or I'll show you guys about uh, later on. And then this is a note. I feel like this note was for Kai, because it says, guy, get your ass on Naruto already. <laughs> Because my man has not watched it yet, so shout out to Kai. Because uh, yes, sir, that that is very true. You're gonna have to go and still watch it. Don't wait for the reboot. We got this big sucker. Look at this freaking Dragon Ball Z poster right now. Oh my god, look at this. I see. If I'm not mistaken. That is a Trunks, a Goten, a Vegeta, a Goku Black, Broly, and then Goku, all looking hella gangsta. That is actually pretty sick, I'm not even gonna lie. <laughs> Very original piece, for sure. And of course, on the back. We have like so many of these movie posters, it's gonna be great. I have enough to maybe put a framed version of each of these on like every corner of my house. Oh, there's one more. Hold on, let's see. Oh yeah, look at this. This is what we saw earlier. Paper quality is really nice, actually. It's like, they're like really, it's not like these, the movie posters are like really thick. So these were these prints are are definitely done very well. So shout outs to the, for that. This was an Instagram post. I actually remember him um, throwing this up there. You're better than me, Kakarot, but I am number one. Look at that. That that, that is, I love it. Here's another Broly. Now these are probably some of my favorite ones right here because these are literally all. Um, I believe these are bonus extras on his Patreon, which you of course can. I guess get the prints and so this is this is the Goku's this is Chi Chi's you know you get the color palette and all that and then here is King Vegeta himself so big shout out and it's like like it's so cool just to see every little bit of detail and like just 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 like everything about this is so sick I've never actually collected or had any kind of like art like this before to even celebrate any of my favorite anime like i have i've had posters i have posters and whatnot but like this kind of takes the cake so and again another pamphlet so we got we <laughs> we have so many of these we, we might as well just start mass producing these and put this freaking fight on you know what i'm saying all right and now here we go so we're going a little bit further away from dragon ball because now we got the cowboy bebop art all right this is a series I actually have to still watch, I'm not gonna lie. This one is amazing. Shout out to Naruto. Oh, this is so good. <laughs> this is so fire. And then check this one. Oh my god. Yo, this is so sick. Oh That's my that god. Good shit. It's literally Goku. I see Vegeta. I see Frieza looming. Uh, there's Majin Buu, Cell, and Broly. And then Shenron's just chilling in the background. So, and they're And they're signed. These are all signed, by the way. You just got to really look for the signature. There's this, there's a signature right there. So if you look really closely at this piece, you see like Goku, you see Vegeta, you see Frieza, you see Buu, Cell, and then Broly, and then Shenron. That is fire. This is really cool. I feel like I know what this is, but I don't know what this is. This is, I feel like I've seen this somewhere. Like this is like another something or other, but it looks really cool. I like it a lot. This actually makes me very interested in seeing, is, is there an animation for this? Because I'd actually like to check it out. Funny enough, that's kind of like how I got into anime was through art. I used to draw, but like I was never uh, 
very good and I, I i passed a certain point i didn't really stick with it this john right here this this, this blood kakashi is od this is actually kind of fire this is really sick so again thank you and there's actually more but i just i can't say thank you enough so i appreciate all of these art pieces this envelope okay now he wrote give it a good home and i actually forgot to show this off on the podcast episode we did a christmas special so check that out episode 86 over on the full power podcast channel and i totally missed this so i have no idea what this is so this is kind of scary just because like he just said give it a good home and i don't even know what this is so i'm not trying to like tear it there we go no way are these the drafts oh <gasps> <laughs> there is no way no dude these are don't tell me these are the originals <laughs> oh. look at this oh my god yo <laughs> i gotta put these in a binder because look they have the punch holes right on the side Holy crap, hold on. I gotta be really careful with these. Do you remember this? And then the next scene, look. Oh, shit, that's so sick. Oh my god. Yo, why did he give me this? This is amazing. I don't, I gotta ask him. Are these like, nah, there's no way these are the originals. There's no way he sent me the originals of this. There's zero way these are the originals. I hope these are not the originals. <laughs> Yo, and then like, wow. So like, I really like, so. He goes bald for a second because of all the flashing. I, you gotta like look at it like this. Like, it's like frame by frame. What? I cannot believe this. These are, I'm so lost for words. I can't, I really can't. Like he's got all these little images. This is how animation works. You, you literally draw every little frame one by one. Dude, dude how many sheets is this? This is the last page right here. When you see like when he gets knocked back, <laughs> I can't believe this. I'm, I'm so sorry, guys. I'm like literally just lost for words right now because I could very well be holding the originals to legend. Not the whole entire film, but this is like the storyboard. Yeah, look, you can even see like how the, the, the order of the scenes work. This is that one section of the part where Broly is charging up his blast and then he gets blown back or he gets blown back and then he does it so this is like in reverse order i want to say oh my god this is what a freaking christmas let me tell you and i can't believe i should have saved this for last because this is something i did not expect to ever get i definitely have to put these in laminated sheets and put them all in a binder they can't just sit in this envelope and i cannot believe he gave me this this is insane this literally has an october 20th what is that 2013 date i don't even know if he's up but i just sent him a message right now i cannot deal this is so this is too real okay 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 last but not least let's get the, let's get this video video over with all my life i've trained for this one moment so this is the special item aside from everything else that um i got um, this was this is an actual super duper collectible now I don't have the means in this room to actually throw this VHS tape in my CRT that has those built-in uh, You know tape players. I wanted to at least open this up that y'all can actually see You know the entirety of this of this thing. So it's like it's like taped shut right here so. Like I said on the episode when we were talking about this when I was opening up for the first time I kind of don't want to open this but I'm committing to showing you guys. Just opening it up right here so I can just... Oh, oh my god. Oh my god. I'm holding the actual tape right here. Legend Drive Ball Tail, bro. This is sick. I'm not even gonna lie. And you know, it, it, the cool thing about this is that everything about the project is so retro and vintage. And it like, you can tell just like, like the animation style itself, of course. But like, the fact that he chose... Oh my god, and it's he signed it. <laughs> Nasir, you're killing me! Yo, and it's like, it literally has a print. Like, look. <laughs> That's the thumbnail right there. That has to be. Oh my god. Like, 
Legend of Dragon Ball Tale, bro. I can't believe this. I'm genuinely curious if he took my joke and he made it happen for my copy. Because I said, I said, yo. So he showed me, funny story, he showed me that he was doing this ahead of time before he put it out there. And I said, bro, if you can figure out how to actually put the the actual movie on this tape, you're already a god, but like, you're like the god of gods. You're like Zenosama at this point, right? It even says right here, 10 minutes approximate runtime dubbed in English, color stereo, hi-fi, 2022, Nasir Pasha, new challenger animation, straight dog animation, all rights reserved <laughs> for private home use only, duplicate of this video without prior licensing, causing it to be seen or heard in public is completely meaningless as the tape is empty. That's literally what it says right there. That is so cool. Now here, check out the back of the box art. Oh man, this is so sick. I can't, but like the amount of detail gone into this entire, like I got my own little collector set of, of all the legend things you can imagine. Like all the things I'm pretty sure if you go on his store, which I'll have a link in the description, like I have it all. I have all the art. I have this, like this is insane. So you guys can actually get this yourselves. Um, if, if it, if it, if it interests you, but this is like amazing. He signed it, you know, this is the tape itself. And honestly, if it is blank, I'm going to figure out how to put the movie onto this film. If it's at all possible. I'm sure it is. They've probably got some conversions or something. Hey, I beat you. So this was a very special Christmas. Um, I'm going to actually unbox, um, a fight stick that I got on my video game channel. So if you're not subscribed to me over there, I'd really appreciate it if you could check me out on that channel as well. Link in the description as always. And I do hope you guys had a nice holiday yourselves. If you do celebrate Christmas, of course, or whatever, uh, holiday that you do celebrate. And I hope you enjoyed this art because a lot of this like stuff is super sick. I did not expect to get all of these things. And um, like I mentioned over on the Full Power Podcast, I will try my best to see how I can frame all of this so that I can display it in our background and whatnot. So I'm really happy. Thank you to my girl. Thank you to Brother Ooch. Thank you to Nasir. And of course, thank you to you all for watching this. And uh yeah just sticking it out i know it's been a pretty awesome year it's been up and down not gonna lie with a lot of things but i'm just glad to still be doing this and i'm looking forward to the future and i know this is not really like a wrap-up year type of video but i'm kind of treating it like one at on the spot so with all with all that being said i hope that 2023 we can keep growing and climbing and you know still keeping it real so thank you guys make sure you guys are liking sharing subscribing and we'll watch legend if you haven't already because this is it's still the greatest fan animation of all time like that's no cap and take care of yourselves may the power protect keep it locked with it right here on this channel stay safe stay clean stay inside i'll see you guys next time